Well, hello there, everyone, and welcome back to my channel. It's Ariana here, and I'm very excited for this video. If you can't tell by the title and by my lanyard, I am finally introducing to you all my dream car. Well, it's no longer a dream, it's a dream come true. I am so excited to introduce to you all my 1988 Nissan 300ZX. I'll talk about, I'm going to talk about it a little bit before I go out there and show it to you all. But my Nissan is, I owned one several years ago, and I'm going to try to find a picture, so there may or may not be a picture at the end of this video, depending if I can find one online. I'm pretty sure I have one on my Facebook page somewhere, but I'm not sure. Anyways, I owned one when I was 16. It was my third car when I was 16. By the time I was 16, I had three cars already. And I remember when I got it, my last one was in such dire shape, it was just completely... It was in a dire, dire need of work, and I couldn't find a body shop to work on it. It was rusted. There was just a lot of problems with it. The interior was all torn up, so I couldn't find anybody to work on it for me. So when I turned, when I got my driver's license, my mom got me a new car, but said I had to give it to the Nissan. So I got rid of it, but I told myself I'll own one again one day. I was told though that I was just a young kid dreaming big, and I'll never have another car like that. So I proved everyone wrong. My dream came true by owning my dream car again. I am so, I am so happy to finally have it back. Of course, though, whenever something good happens to me, something bad always happens. On the way, my Cavalier had been acting up for a little while, and on the way to pick up my Nissan the other day, I was about six miles from the garage, and my car over started overheating. So I had to pull over, and I had to call the garage I was going to pick my Nissan up from. It said, "Listen, I need you to come pick me up, tow me." So. I had to get my Cavalier towed from, my car's pretty much switched places. Two months ago, my Nissan was on the very same tow truck going to the garage. Almost two months to the day. It was December 1st, and my Nissan got towed December, October 9th, so almost two months to the day. My Nissan got towed. My Cavalier's on a tow truck getting towed. It's always something, but I am so excited to go out and show it to you all. I'm going to be giving you a nice good look over of it. I'm going to take a little video of me riding in it and taking it down the road. I am just so excited. Can't wait to have my Cavalier back, though. I love my Cavalier just as much as the Nissan. And that way, once I get the Cavalier back, then the Nissan could finally be where it's supposed to be. Sitting in the garage all winter until spring. So, I'm going to take you all out to see it, everyone. I hope you're all ready, everyone, because here is the Nissan. My beautiful 1988 Nissan 300ZX. As you know, this is my dream car. It is my baby. I have been wanting one for so long since my last one. Absolutely beautiful. I'm going to do a nice little walk around for you all so you can all take a look at the car. As you can tell, it's in immaculate shape. I got an amazing price on it. I was going to be doing a lot to this car. But honestly, I like the originality of it. I'm going to put my finger here so you don't see my license plate. But, my beautiful 1988 Nissan 300ZX. I absolutely love her. I like the original, like I was saying, no, I like the originality of it. I was going to originally place the rims, the radio. But the only, thing I'm gonna, the only things I'm going to do now is I'm going to replace the speakers and I'm going to put, I'm going to tint the windows. Other than that, I'm keeping everything the same. Now let's give you a little tour of the inside, everyone. I absolutely love this car. Ah, my baby. Oh, as you can also tell, it's a T-top. So very nice for the summertime. As you can tell, I have the inside all pinked out. My pink tiger stripe seats, my little bow pillows on there, my beautiful steering wheel cover my with hand stitched roses built into it, or not built into it, but stitched into it, my floor mats, they made this look black, I have other floor mats underneath of them, they match the seats, but I don't want to get them dirty, so I gotta buy clear floor mats so you can still see them, but I saw so I can also protect them, trunks in amazing condition, this whole entire car is just in amazing shape. It has a cassette player in it. I've never, I haven't owned a car with a cassette player in such a long time. I honestly can't put into words how much I love this car. 
At the end of this video, there will be a few pictures of this car. So, I'll take a few nice few pictures at the end and give them, put them at the end for you all. The trunk. These right here are the covers for the inside of the sunroof and the T-top if I ever want to cover them up. And this right here, I'm not honestly sure what it is. I think it's a cover for... Honestly, I don't even know what it is to be honest with you. My, since my car doesn't have back seats, I put the back floor mats that for the mattress front ones in the trunk here. And yeah. Alrighty, everyone. Well, time to take a little ride in it. Here we go, everyone. Take a nice little cruise in it. Let's go up the road and back. I'm also going to shoot you under the hood whenever we get back. That way I can. She runs absolutely beautiful. I absolutely love her. She picks up speed extremely quickly. I absolutely love this car. I absolutely love her. It is so much different from my Cavalier because I'm not used to this fast of a car. So, whenever I first started driving it the other day again, it was like, whoa, the ca my Cavalier is a little 2.2 engine, this is a V6, so there's a big difference there. My Cavalier is a little two-cylinder, so, oh my god, just absolutely beautiful. Words can't explain how much I love this car. I love how everything's all digital in here. My, my Cav I haven't had a car that has anything digital in it in such a long time. And I absolutely love it. Oh, let me show, I want to show you guys something cool real quick. Okay, so... The radio, and if you put the radio on... Antenna comes up, and also... I want to show you something else cool with the front of the car. The headlights. <clears throat> one of my favorite features with this car, I just, I don't know. It's one of, the, one of the many reasons I fell in love with it. Just I love the old school styled cars. Now, time to get a little glimpse of under the hood. Here is underneath the hood of my Nissan, everyone. I'm not used to an engine this big. I'm, like I said, I'm used to my little two-cylinder Cavalier, so this is so much more power than I'm used to, but I honestly love it. Alrighty, everyone. Well, there'll be some pictures of this at the end of the video. I hope you all enjoyed the Nissan, meaning my dream car. Bye, everyone.